Siege are now suffering on the tickets here. Let's see if Dark Viper has been able to get back in the air now. Oh, refueling station is white. If that goes up for USMC, I believe that does put BF2C back on the bleed. Or excuse me, TG so back on the bleed. There are actually plenty of TG guys on that flag, and it looks like it is going to go back to the USMC. Oh no, they got taken out. So it does look like TG are now black back on bleed. And just as I say that, lower down goes back up. Looks like we may have a push starting here on uh, Material Station, BB. If you want to get your camera over there, see one or two guys heading in that direction. And it looks like Dark Viper is back in the air now, so it looks like Pinoch has stopped his assault there, and Viper's back in action. Have we seen much from the uh, chopper crew from the U.S. side, the uh, attack chopper? Actually, I've seen a the lot of MI-28 kills. Actually, the Cobra did take down Hatchet and Seaman right at the lower dam there, and then uh, he tried to fly underneath to the bomb section of the lower dam, but he got shot down by a tank shell. Looks to me like the two MI-28s are actually working very closely together. You can see they're always hovering very close. And Viper, again, taking down Hatchet and Z-Man. This is going to make a big difference if Viper can stay up in the air. Those helos are in real trouble. He specializes in being able to take out helos with cannons only, so they don't even know they're being attacked. Oh, and Viper's been taken down by the SU. And then uh, Pinocha swoops by and take down the F-15, so both U.S. jets are down. This can uh, spell trouble for a uh, tactical gamer. So right now, BF2C is enjoying total air superiority. And USMC is now bleeding up for TG. Yeah, it does look like that uh, the Cobras are just camping the exits coming out of, uh, I believe that's called Abandoned Village? Abandoned Huts, yes. BF2C just now adding insult to injury. TG is on the bleed, but uh, I haven't seen any blue come up in a long time. Yeah, it looks to me like the air power is really shutting them down on the entry here. And actually, now that and it looks like Dark Viper is trapping the SU here. SU is already hurting, and Dark Viper's got missiles firing at him. And Viper takes out the SU, UTS host, and Swifty. And the bomber taking out Pinocha. That's gotta hurt. In the 15, no less. <laughs> Gonna have to get some gets screenshots of that. 15 gets a no, nice bomb. Immediately it. afterwards, now gets him on respawn as well. Pinocha respawns and now hits him again on the ground. Oh, a little payback, maybe? A little We're now out to a 100 ticket deficit though, so TG's got to start working on the ground here. They're doing good things in the air, but to get back this bleed. Yeah, they've definitely got to go for uh, some unorthodox way, but it looks like, you know, they're keeping the armor right up there towards the U.S. main, holding any of the armor back, and the MIs are doing most of the hard work, you know, if anyone breaks free. Uber Soldat coming in big with a chopper kill on... Botafuca and Whiskey 6. And it looks to me like Viper took out a taking off MEC jet, but got taken down by the tool whisker.
Yeah, right now all the capital flags belong to Mac. Uh, U.S. are just stuck at the uh, their armor base and the air base. They gotta find a way to sneak out here. Yeah, TG definitely got their backs against the wall here right now. Ticket count 87, 196 in favor of BF2C. The bleed is on TG. Not wanting to let the cat out the black, but uh, they've got, uh, I think, one uh, squad leader up at the uh, top northern base at Supervisor Base. And there it goes. Okay, so that does uh, stop the bleed for the time being, and it looks like uh, Big Bill and Tempest are the ones responsible, as well as a couple others. Uh, looks like TG Bane too. I was able to tell the Tim Brisk has got that, and the tank's starting to roll up there, so they're really going to need to... Oh! Oh, UTS takes that half that squad. And Tempest going down. We've got an armor push from both sides here. We've got two tanks, a Tunguska from the south, and three tanks from the north, including a stolen US tank from the looks of it. Yes, indeed, but there is a full squad of TG here, so uh, right now only one vehicle in flag cap. He does get hit with an Eric shot, and I do have Artie coming in. That's going to end up being B BF2C's Artie, only picking up one kill thus far. The interesting thing see if TG notices this big armor column because this would be that opportunity to hit one of the back flags. Yeah, TG's in, in real trouble here at uh, Supervisor Base. Not only is now four pieces of armor here, four main battle tanks plus infantry, they brought the world. They've also got a chopper here cleaning up as well. And one thing I've noticed is that uh, BFTC don't seem to have lost many tickets at all in the last five minutes. During this whole time that TG's been on bleed, they have, BF2C have stuck around 190 or so tickets. Oh, Dark Viper coming up big there, getting picking up two kills on Uber Soldat and Black Ops in the MI-28. Viper is also now tiling the SU. This is going to be an interesting fight. What? Oh, he crashed into oh, the mountain. Oh, into the hill. Whoever the Sioux pilot is, I believe that's Swifty. He just lucked out there because that 18 had him for dinner. It looks like we do have another TG push right now on Supervisor Base as it goes gray. We got four deep here on the flag. That's going to be Squad 2 again. And BF2C guys are straining in here one at a time trying to stop them, but uh, to no avail. The flag does go up. The bleed is now off 20 to 181 in favor of BF2C. Yeah, pretty amazing. In the last, TG has probably lost about 60 tickets to BF2C's 10 in the last five minutes or so. Looks like there's MI-28 really ruling the battlefield at the moment. Yeah, I was going to say, uh, Hatchet and Z-Man really getting it done, pulling their weight on uh, this half of the map. It'll be interesting to see who, which of the two chopper crews will actually be in the Cobra come next round. Looks like North Supervisor, Supervisor Base is getting uh, pummeled again. Yeah, it looks to me like BF2C is not too concerned about those flags going up, and they really don't care about bleed at this stage. As you can see, I think the last 90 TG tickets only cost BF2C about 20. A 15 coming in on a strike, only picking up one. And that's it, folks. Third round ends 172 to 0. If you guys could read off the top three from your side, and we can uh, get this fourth round started. Looks like we've got Bleak on TG side doing some heavy medic work by the looks of it. Going 5 and 12, but 31 teamwork. Shaky, 7 and 9. Dark Viper, 13 and 8 in the Jets. Looks like all the scores go to the BF2C Helos. 
Yeah, lo looking the rundown on the top three from the, the BF2C guys, we've got 47 for five coming out for Z-Man, 21, uh, minus two on the Medic though. Uh, 